This young woman is accused of murdering a loyal servant of the king. Who here bears witness to her crimes? I will speak to them. This man is a traitor and a murderer! Gullied. Shameful! Hang her head! Kill her! She's innocent! A disgrace to her family name! Mira Forrester, in the sight of gods and men, and in the name of the king, I sentence you to die. Shame! Kill her! If you have final words, speak them now. She's innocent! Kneel. I don't want it. I'm not gonna do it. <laughs> All right. Give me be. Nope, wasn't fucking saved. No. <laughs> okay then. We're literally we down to like so one and a half. <laughs> Game. I'm a little upset about what that one. <laughs> <laughs> They were nothing but stark loyalists. And the Starks are dead. Are you listening, Reek? Father wanted to make sure they'd bend the knee. And what do I find? A child lord. Ethan the Bold. <laughs> With some parasite by his side. As if I'd come to negotiate. <laughs> and I thought, oh, this is going to be fun. Mira was so devoted when we first came to King's Landing. That day Cersei dragged her before the throne. Grandmother, I was actually worried for her. But she didn't have any trouble swearing loyalty to Joffrey right in front of me. Then she had the audacity to go behind my back with Tyrion when I'd clearly forbade it. And then that letter she forged to Elena Glenmore, as if I wouldn't find out. It was bold, I'll give her that. But I can't forgive that she used me. And now, with all that's happened to her, who knows what else Mira was doing without my knowledge. Grandmother, it makes me question if she was ever loyal to me at all. I really didn't choose a lot of stuff, but a lot of people did. I saw something of myself in Garrett Tuff. I thought I could trust in him, Sam. But I was wrong. 
He gave me his word that he'd stay true to the vows he'd made in the Godswood. Yet before her day was out, her brother was dead atop the wall. I needed his sword at Craster's. I'd offended him to Frostfinger. And it cost me. Whatever happened up there, a man of the watch doesn't run away. Who should return then? But another Lord Forrester. Roderick. Back from the twins with balls so shrunken he let Griff White he'll beat him into the mud in his own yard. Reek, I had to come and see this walking tragedy for myself. But then, he jabbed out that fourthborn's eye. He, he killed the man who betrayed him. I was rather startled. <coughs> A shame he didn't last longer. Roderick. Savior who couldn't save any. There was something about Asher Forrester. You would have liked him, Miss Sandai. He was cocky, surely, but he wasn't uncharming. Asher needed my help. I needed to know if he deserved it, so I tested him. But I was disappointed. He seemed a man who cared of nothing more than the moment. But afterward, his uncle told me the truth. That Asher had been protecting his friend, a former slave. He had gave up all he came here for to protect her secret. He earned my respect in the end. If not my help. Loyalty. Friendship. Respect. Without them, we have... nothing. I don't know if Mira ever understood that, grandmother. I know she told me the truth about Sarah, but she also broke a promise to Sarah to keep a secret. In the end, I respect that she was willing to do whatever it took to get what she wanted. But at so high a cost. I could have told you this story wasn't going to have a happy ending. Roderick dead, his mother dead, his little pile of timber in ruins. I just wish I'd been there to see it. That Bolton bastard let their upstart houses go to war, Father. I'm not unfamiliar with these foresters. Stubborn to the end. They fought hard, I'll give them that. But they were too bold, defiant when they should have been smart. Ruthless instead of shrewd. When will these northerners ever learn? The Starks are dead. The war is over. And they lost. I mean, 14.3% fought with unwavering conviction. So, we plus 14.3% stay true to a specific cause rather than jump back and forth. Yeah. Game, like it. I'm angry now. I know. Oop. We haven't much time.
choices. They like rush this game out or something? What in the way? Time to work tomorrow. The sleep in is Saturday. I'm still really mad. What's the thing you're mad most about? It's, it's literally the, the two endings that we were given. One that you played that girl, then you tried to like cheat and steal and sneak your way into some kind of help for the family, and you did so throughout the entire game. And in the end, you've done nothing for them, and you died anyway. Yeah. And then the other ones, like you went through eight hundred fucking floors of one house, and it fell. So it was pretty much like a season of Game of Thrones. But it was worse this way because you were invested in each <laughs> character, right? <laughs> Is this four hour stream? <laughs> you have no life. Because <laughs> we weren't entertaining at all. <laughs> <laughs> 